Yeah, so I have a few videos I'm, I'm working on, but uh, while I wait to get those finished, I wanted to do a video on SDR Angel again, uh, but this time using it to transmit with a HackRF, and we'll also receive with an RTL SDR using uh, GQRX. All this is built into Dragon OS, and uh, I want to point out, you know, of course, with broadcasting, you, there's a lot of considerations there, you know, power and legal, et cetera, et cetera. Um, the HackRF, very low power. I've got it down here. It's right next to an RTL SDR. So with that in mind, I just want to show uh, pulling up, let's see, SDR Angel. HackRF is already plugged in. Um, what we want to do right off the bat is we want to add a sync device, which I didn't cover before. So you can see it adds a sync device. It defaults at 435 megahertz. That's fine for the purposes of this demonstration. And we want to come down here. We want to left click on the little pointer. We want to add our HackRF. You can see it's identified there. We want to add a WFM modulator. I'll, sh I'll show that. That throws it off here to the right hand side, which gives you even more options. Uh, something I want to look at is the audio input. Now I only had a headset laying around. It was um, it doesn't work well at all, uh, but it's it's all that I have. So I recommend a USB headset or something like that. Um, but once you have that plugged in and you start up SDR Angel, if you right click the audio input, you'll see you can select the audio devices. Something USB is probably going to stick out like a sore thumb. Uh, for me, I'm going to try system default device uh, because I, I have a headset plugged into just the older uh, head, headphone style jack. It's got the separate microphone and, and a headset. Well, either that or it's the ALSA input. But uh, let's see, what else? We, uh, the Some of these other defaults, or yeah, defaults that you can adjust are the uh, audio bandwidth, the modulation percentage. Uh, I'm going to try, I'll turn up the audio input gain a little bit here. And we would left click to, to activate that microphone. So, but before I start transmitting, let's pull up, I'll also go into internet, GQRX. We'll let it start up. Well, you can see I've already got my Realtek device selected. I've left all defaults there. Um, I did uh, check mark the option, the top option here, the automatic gain control. I cranked up gain a little bit. I was trying this out. And then I changed mode to the WFM. So we can see right now there's nothing. There's nothing there. So if I jump back over here and I kick the HackRF on, you can see we're now transmitting. And if I click the audio input, you can see that I'm essentially just tapping it, that I'm transmitting. So again, can't really show much uh, without, I, let's see. You can see the audio up there. It's picking up some of what I'm saying. Um, Let's see. We just really won't be able to hear it come across here without me yelling in everyone's ear, but uh, you get the point. You can set that up, you can transmit, and then you can receive it with your RTL SDR. That's a short, simple, sweet, right to the point. 